So I'm going to say this, and I hope you don't take it the wrong way. I did not like Paris one bit. Ah, uh, yes, once again, we are back. We are back. Hi, nice to see you guys again. If you guys are new here, please drop a comment, like the video, subscribe if you haven't already to be the first one notified. My name is Mighty Mutz. Nice to see you guys. Nice to see you guys. Nice to meet you guys. I am a little excited. I'm a little pumped up. Today, uh, we are going to go over the footage of uh, the Paris trip. And if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, uh, if you guys were to please go back to my last video and watch that one, LAX Paris last year, one year ago today, we woke up in Paris. Uh, we woke up around 10 a.m. We started uh, kind of just we got up we got our we got up we got dressed uh, uh, me Moby and Zachary we all went we went out to uh, to the to the we all went to this little shop this little market around the corner and we were walking and it's just like it was our first day first visit you know our first actual full day in Europe and we're walking around like whoa this is such a change seeing the little euro sign instead of like a dollar sign or a cent sign it's so trippy and we were we were trying to get food and they don't really sell the food like how they do here if you get me everything is different everything's not in bulk everything is like separated it's one of those things where you just have to be there and, and i I'm, I'm sorry i can't really uh explain it that well but it's just seeing those things and seeing like everything's first off everything is healthy so we got a few things we went back to the spot hung out there for a little bit tech was finally like getting around so i think um we started texting him and trying to see where he was and maybe we could meet up with him i think he took a different route from the the train station to us so we were kind of like uh, trying to meet up in the middle so it turns out apparently in that part of paris or i don't know maybe paris in general they do not serve food until noon so no breakfast nothing until noon we luckily found a spot it was like a bar and we asked them oh is your kitchen open they said no it's not until noon and we we're like oh man we're hungry and we we're not from here and we want like we we're just hungry we want food because everything they sell they sold at the market is thing like food that you would make like you would have to like cook which is understandable and i get i get it but it's just like man they don't have like little packets of food they don't have like to-go food they don't have things like that uh, we were telling him this and he was just like so you know what yeah we'll we'll start we'll start cooking up today we'll start cooking up right now like at 10 30 or 11. So we got our food we found tech we were all together and we ordered beer because we could we enjoyed our first morning brunch i guess you could say so being out there in europe we had a few things on our mind for 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 the travel days for the days that we were not in rotterdam uh everything around it barcelona paris uh, uh amsterdam were all days that we set out to film videos so we were just filming music videos just filming content just taking pictures those were our days i think the last day was like kind of like the fun day and we didn't really do much but everything else every other day that we were not in rotterdam we were filming for music videos so for this day for paris uh zay called in she said she wanted to film for her video called quiet loud it's right here If you guys have seen it before, that's where we filmed it. We filmed most of the shots in Paris. I think, I haven't seen it in a while, but I think all of it's in Paris. Oh, that's right. Little bits and pieces are from Amsterdam, but for the most part, it's all in Paris. It's all in Europe. But for the side of it, we filmed a little bit for tech and we filmed a little bit for us. So for us, for Soul Providers, we filmed for this video um, right here. Seeing all these buildings and people and dogs out and like um and green, so green, it's so green everywhere. But like the buildings itself, you could just tell they have history. Everything around us was just filled with history, filled with like years and years of it being there. The architecture, the the people around, the the what they're wearing, people what people how they act, how they they 
they they gather themselves how they are with people you kind of did feel a like a fish out of water when you were walking around and and it's kind of it kind of feels like um like it like it just you know it just doesn't feel right it doesn't feel good to be walking around um i don't know a big group of mexicans or a big group of uh, of, of of latin descent and we're all just kind of walking around minding our own business but we do kind of see the looks it, it does you do feel it um it, it's not it's it's noticeable it is noticeable so it's a little weird i myself had a film camera i had my sony camera and moby over here he had his film camera he had his uh his sony camera so we we're all just kind of having fun walking around we we're trying to find things things like places to to be and like little alleys and little things like that kind of like get the most of the paris experience <laughs> the details on the water fountains you could just tell everything had history and you can see everything about it everything is perfect everything is beautiful and yes little things like that are kind of so special and like little moments like this is just so so beautiful like you just it's just you know you have to be there you you do have to be there you do have to experience paris for at least one day even if you didn't like it, if you, even if you don't like it, you do have to experience Paris, like at least once in your life. So we did try to go to the catacombs, but um, it's just, it was so hot that day. And like, there was just, you know, a big, big attractions like that are bound to have long lines. And we're obviously tourists and we want to see touristy things. Like we went to, we took the train over there. We took the train all the, all the way to um to the catacombs and it turns out it was just it was a line a, a line just a line around the block and we were just like screw this we're not gonna do that one thing i do gotta say after trying to see the catacombs after um going to the fountains after seeing all these buildings and and plants and everything in between the one thing that i would recommend you do and this is a big big recommendation that you have to do in your life is go see the eiffel tower you have to see the eiffel tower we have to be there as the sun sets to experience it both obviously during the sun and during the sunset and during the night because we want to just we want to see it that was the one thing that everybody agreed on everybody wanted to do uh the museums everybody wanted to do um the catacombs everybody wanted to do this or that or this it's it's a big group thing and it just sucks that you're there for like a day or two and the lines are just extremely long you can't get in it so pretty much if you're in paris you only have maybe one or two things that you can do all day and everything else is just you just kind of have to um try to try again another day but for us we don't have another day we this was the main thing that we wanted to do everybody agreed on it this is what we're doing everybody's gonna everybody wants to go see the eiffel tower so we took an uber all the way to the eiffel tower I was trying to film um, everything in between. And when, when I got to the Eiffel Tower, everybody else kind of went ahead and I waited, I think I waited for Zay and I waited for someone and we were walking up and I was like, I didn't know where it was. We were, uh, we got dropped off in a building and I think we were heading north and we were walking up and I was like, damn, where is it? Like, I can't see it. Like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see it. Like, I, there's no way I can't see it. And I'm walking and I'm walking and I think I have the video clip and if I do, I'm gonna show it right now. And then I looked up and I was like, oh shit. It's right here. And then I had to walk around, had to make my way in, had to get checked and I'd get my bag checked and everything, and then go in, go inside. And I'm, walk, I'm going inside and I'm walking around it. I'm walking below it and I'm looking at the construction. I'm looking at the iron. I'm looking at the metal. I'm looking at the bolts. I'm looking at everything. And it's just so fascinating, so amazing to see these things. Um, this thing was built over a hundred years ago. I don't know how they made this over a hundred years ago. People died making this and it's just, it's a steeple. It's a, it's a, it, this is the steeple. This is the capital. This is the main attraction. This is it. This is Paris and just being there <laughs> and filming and just being there and being in awe of it. And I just, this is, I have a little shot right here and this shot. I was pretty much, I told myself I'm going to film this shot because I was lying down. I, I like straight up, I was sitting down at one point and then I just lied down and I looked up at it and I was, it, it, this, it was just like a quiet moment I just had with me and the Eiffel Tower and it was just so, it was so, it was so peaceful seeing something built hundreds of, hundreds, over a hundred years ago. 
and seeing it built right before me and being from, you know, being a Mexican, being from Southgate, California, being here and just watching it. I just, it took, it literally took my breath away. I was like, wow, like this is amazing. Like it made the whole trip worth it. First day out <laughs> and it made the whole trip worth it. Afterwards, we just went to this uh, little restaurant right across, uh, right around the corner from the from the Eiffel Tower, and we all had uh, we all had dinner. We all had uh, different pastas and uh, different meals. And one thing for sure, everybody wanted to try. Everybody wanted to try this es the escargot. Everybody wanted to try it. I said, "Fuck that! I was not trying that shit. Not one bit." Everybody else could try it. I'm going, "Fuck! I am not trying that. Nope, nope, nope. Not trying it." What's up? We are here at a restaurant. Finally, our body eats snails. But what are they called? That's cargo. That's cargo. But yeah, we're about to get down and drink with some snails, y'all. Go see our style. All you feed me are puffins. I'm excited. Okay, hungry. It kind of smells like mushrooms. I don't like mushrooms. <laughs> He's like, oh, that, I'm gonna show him this motherfucker. You do which one? Everybody, hey. cheers. Hey. Don't touch because it's gonna like fall. <laughs> but cheers, y'all. Smells? Yeah. It's what I find. It was much better the first time. Yeah? Much better the first time? It's cold. That was a lingering smell, yeah. It's cold. That was a uh, I did not. I do not regret it. I do not regret that one bit. <laughs> oh man! After this, we kind of just walked around, enjoyed the the Paris streets, and uh, we took the Uber home. And then we just fell asleep. And we had to. I think me and Moby had to wake up like around four or five just to get ready and go to the airport and then head to Barcelona. For me and Moby, definitely. But um, we just had to. We experienced. We experienced Paris the way we could. Everybody else stayed and they enjoyed Paris the way they could. And. Um, yeah, I would not trade that trip that day for anything in the world. That's going to do it for this video. If you guys like it, please drop a thumbs up. If you guys have a question, please drop a comment in the comment section below. If you guys are not subscribed already, please subscribe to be the first one notified. My name is Mighty Muds. Nice to see you guys again. If you guys are new here, please, please subscribe. Uh, everything is, is great. I'm loving everybody. Uh, interacting with me on the on the comments. Uh, next up is Barcelona. Barcelona, it was was intense to say the least uh we woke up super early we were super jet lagged and uh we filmed i think four videos we filmed four music videos in one day you guys have to check it out um yeah just stay tuned barcelona coming soon barcelona coming in a few days actually or it should be tomorrow i don't know whenever you see this probably be the next day yeah all right guys peace out